All right, guys, what is going on with everybody today? Victor of Quanception Films back here with another Yu-Gi-Oh! video for you guys. Today, we're uh, looking at a Def Pro tutorial. I'm going to be teaching you guys how to add custom skins and uh, sleeves and backgrounds on Yu-Gi-Oh! Dev Pro. So uh, yeah, let's jump right in today. So if we're on Dev Pro on the game list, we want to go to the Customize tab right there. And then where it says content down here, you want to click on here. And then if we want to uh, customize our sleeves per se, then we'll go to player one covers. Uh, and then here's my custom sleeve. It's Akame from Akamega Kill. And uh, so how you want to go about adding your own sleeve is first of all, you want to have a correctly sized uh, image or else it's going to look all distorted if you know what I'm saying and so we can press on add and you just find the picture that you want as your sleeve so if I go down to uh, my desktop and then I go to my folder that contains my uh, sleeves right here so if I want this image to be my sleeve then I'll press open and then I'll press yes when it prompts me to resize the image to the correct size and since I already have it uh, it's just gonna default to that again. All right, and then you click on your newly added sleeve and then you right click on it and you'll press install, success, there you go, there's a prompt. And then we press preview and let's load this up. As you can see, our sleeves are customized to the Akamega Kill sleeves that we had. So let's just get out of here. And uh, so yeah, next up we have wall papers and backgrounds. So let's go to backgrounds. So here are the, the backgrounds that I've installed. So again, we'll go to add and we'll go to desktop. We'll go to our wallpapers folder. And if I want this image from here lie in April, then it's going to resize the image to the correct size. And when the prompt comes up, I say yes. And then we're going to install this success and we're going to preview it. All right, so as you can see, this is our wallpaper. And then we're gonna go into the duel. As you can see, the uh, the background has not changed, so I'm gonna show you guys how to change the wallpaper for the actual uh, in-game um, wallpaper. And uh, what you do is you press on game backgrounds, and then you'll want to add a wallpaper here and do basically what you did for the other two uh, tutorials. And uh, let's go to wallpapers. If I go to fairy tale and I want this image and then I'll right click on it press install success okay and then we'll preview it load replay okay load replay wait one second for it to buffer there you go as you can see it's correctly installed and just for another example if I want to change if I want to change my wallpaper to a different one, like if I want this Akame wallpaper, then I'll press install again on this one after right clicking, and then we'll press preview. Okay, let's let's see. Let's wait for this to buffer, and there you go. All right, so let's go into an actual a duel and see if uh, the sleeves and wallpapers turned out right. There you go. As you can see, the wallpaper and the sleeves are correctly uh, formatted and uh, are correctly formatted, so that's pretty cool. And uh, yeah, if you enjoyed this video, found it helpful and all, uh, be sure to smack that like button. It does help our channel out greatly. And uh, this is Victor of Conception Films, and we'll see you guys on the flippity flip. Do subscribe for more content if you want to see more Yu-Gi-Oh content like this, and uh, yeah. Uh, leave a comment down below telling me what you want to see next. Alright, this has been Victor Paul Inception Films, and we'll see you guys.